Well, a U.S. Navy veteran who's currently living in Florida was ordered by the Homeowners Association that he had to remove his American flag wrap on his mailbox, saying that he was violating rules and everything like that according to how many days you can have uh, these sort of patriotic decorations up you know, after a holiday and all this and that. I saw this man interviewed uh, over the weekend. I meant to do a video on it then. Uh, everything, uh, of course, those of you that follow me, everything, I had to put my dog to sleep, unfortunately. I didn't get a chance to report on this story. Um, but uh, I'm, I'm kind of glad I got to, to wait a little bit at least because he has actually won the dispute. Now, originally, he was told that he had to get it removed. In fact, they gave him a deadline uh, as far as when he had to get this taken down. He went and complained, said it was a form of bullying, that there was never an issue before all the other years he's lived there. Uh, and so good for him, all right? So... He's claiming victory now in this dispute over a patriotic mailbox outside of his Tallahassee home, saying that the local homeowners association has backed down, backed down from its order to remove it for not being in consonance with the aesthetic values of the rest of the neighborhood. Oh, the aesthetic values, it's so important. God forbid we have the American flag, guys, right? Well, the former, the former veteran had said, and so in the report that he was informed Monday that the Southwood Residential Community Association changed the rules to now allow American flag wraps on homeowners' mailboxes. The decision came after the man, Akert, appealed to the initial letter asking him to remove the colorful mailbox wrapping. This is what he had to say. I view this as a form of bullying, to be honest, he said in the statement. And I think that people should stand up to bullying of any form and particularly this one. The initial letter from the HOA, according to Akert, stated this, quote, As the holiday season comes to a close, please remove the American flag mailbox wrap. Akert said that he had told the mailbox display and had that in front of the house for the past four years. Never a problem before, guys. Never a problem before. Well, <laughs> good for Navy officer John Akert, who has now won this dispute, and he will get to keep his American flag wrap. Can you believe we're living in these kinds of days, guys, where you are living in the United States and they don't even want you to keep a patriotic flag wrap on your mailbox because they're worried that it could possibly offend somebody. I mean, it's insanity. We've gotten to the point where it's like, it's almost offensive. And this is what the left does. They, they try to tell you that it's offensive to be patriotic, that you're being insensitive uh, towards other nationalities and this and that, it's ludicrous. It's completely uterus. I think it's completely ludicrous. I, I thank God that we have a president in Donald Trump who is patriotic, who loves America, who stands and fights for the values of this country. And I'm proud of this veteran for standing his ground. Retired Navy veteran John Aker winning this dispute, keeping his American flag wrapped. We need to fight, guys. We need to fight. I mean, our freedom is under assault like never before, like never before, guys, all right? If you're watching this video right now, and if you've never accepted Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, if you would like to do so today, please let me know. Just leave me a comment below. Let me know you would like to receive Christ as your Lord and Savior today, guys. You could be born again, forgiven of all of your sins. You could come into the, the family of God, really, where you'll have everlasting life and a home in heaven for eternity. Christ is coming back soon. So don't delay. It'll be my honor and privilege to pray with you guys. All right, I'll continue to keep you up to speed here on all the latest breaking news, prophecy headlines, and current world events. All right, guys, I'll be back with more. You guys take care. Please be safe out there. Don't forget to share these videos with your friends and family. God bless each and every single one of you, and I'll talk with you soon.